Opposition party threatens drastic action against rebellious legislators. Sanjizo Chibangu, the self-imposed interim secretary general of the Citizens Coalition for Change CCC, has issued a stern warning to lawmakers who defy party directives and disrupt parliamentary proceedings. Chibangu, in an interview with local media, expressed his disapproval of the recent protests staged by CCC MPs during the swearing-in of new legislators, including Pedzai Scott Sakapwanya, the member of parliament from Abukatafra. As a consequence of their protest, the opposition MPs were forcibly removed from the August House by police and subsequently suspended for four sittings. Shibangu criticized the MPs' actions, stating, It's uncalled for, and we will be engaging Parliament. We know what is lacking in Parliament. It's leadership. We will be engaging the Parliament Caucus. Shibangu who has been a source of contention within the party and a thorn in the side of CCC leader Nelson Chamisa, hinted at the possibility of using recalls as a means to discipline the non-compliant MPs. He justified the recalls by explaining that they were aligned with the party's position, stating, These recalls are not initiated by an individual, they are not initiated by a group of people but they are initiated by the party collectively. If the party decides that recalls are no longer serving the purpose, recalls have really answered the issues that we mentioned before and these issues that we continue to raise. Then we will be guided by the party. In recent months, Chibangu has spearheaded a series of recalls, resulting in the removal of several MPs and councillors from parliament and local councils. In November alone, he recalled 13 MPs and senators, following the earlier removal of 15 MPs nine senators, and councillors in October. CCC President Nelson Chamisa has publicly denounced Chibangu, labeling him an imposter, intent on undermining the progress made by the opposition party. The internal strife within the CCC underscores the challenges faced by opposition parties in maintaining unity and discipline among their ranks. As the party engages in its internal struggle, the repercussions of these ongoing tensions could have far-reaching consequences for its future and its ability to effectively challenge the ruling party. The political landscape remains dynamic, and the actions and decisions made by party leaders and members in the coming days will undoubtedly shape the trajectory of the CCC and its role in the political arena.